Good morning, Gateway Church, and happy Mother's Day. As many of you know, we are one church in multiple locations. And today I have the honor and privilege of, of being 17 miles south at our Oxford campus. If you are a guest here with us today on this really good Mother's Day, I want to say welcome. And thank you for choosing this representation of the body of Christ to serve our Lord today. My name is Scott. I have the opportunity to be the lead pastor here at Gateway Church. And my prayer is that today you will be able to encounter the person of Jesus Christ in a life-changing way. I love the Gateway Church has had the opportunity to sponsor and host the Compassion Experience right here in Parksburg for the Parksburg, Coatesville, and surrounding area. What Compassion is doing around the globe is incredible. And today as a church, we get a chance to partner with them in what they are doing around the globe. And it gives us a chance to put into practice part of our code. Here's part of what we believe. We see disciple making as the call of every believer. We want to invest in children and students. And we view our stewardship through the lens of generosity. And by us sponsoring some children in El Salvador, and not just in El Salvador, but in a specific little village, in a specific church. The Church Esperanza Viva, or the Living Hope Church. And they have been praying, they have been organizing, they have been working for over 18 months to get ready for this weekend. When a group of people in the United States say, we are in and we are ready to invest, not only in children, but in a church that's making a difference in their community. Just last week, I was able to sit in El Salvador with Pastor Jacoby and hear his heart as I spoke with he and his wife about his heart and passion to see the children in his community come to know the person of Jesus Christ and then be educated in him so that they're able to make a difference in their world. Gateway Church and guests, today here's what I'm asking. I'm asking that you and I choose to live on simply less so that a child in El Salvador can simply live. Think about that. That you and I would choose to simply live on less so that a child could simply live. As I told you, I've been there. I've seen it. I've met the people. And I completely and wholeheartedly believe in this project. So I'm thankful for compassion. And now I get the opportunity to introduce you to the man that we've been working with throughout this whole process. My traveling partner in El Salvador, Brian Weber. And this is a man that I trust you can trust him and you can follow his heart. Brian, thank you for being here with us today. And Gateway Church, let's give a warm gateway welcome to Brian Weber. <laughs> 